So apparently LeBron James and Carmelo Anthony are going to be teaming up in 2015. Who knew? What's going on guys? Five Sports Talk 5 is back at it. Yeah, you heard that right man. Carmelo and LeBron teaming up someplace in 2015. Yeah, that's just what Stephen A. Smith was reporting. Uh, so I'm here to discuss that. Listen, my first thoughts upon hearing this was, wow, this is disgusting. And what I mean by that is, look, if Heat players and LeBron James and Wade and Bosch in particular thought the Heat hate was bad right now, if Carmelo joins, the hate is going to be three, four times as much for the Miami Heat. So just from that perspective, that would be terrible. And I'm sure Melo's a guy that appreciates his personal space and his personal life. He's not going to get none of that if he teams up uh, in Miami with the Heat because he'll get ridiculed everywhere he walks around on the streets and whatnot. And he'll probably get like hate from all the fans and whatnot. Another thing that strikes me about this LeBron's not going to go to Melo. Melo has to come to LeBron because he's the one that doesn't have a ring, last time I checked. So, with the, what does that mean? Uh, that means that either LeBron, uh, Carmelo Anthony has to go to Miami or LeBron and Carmelo both go somewhere at place else. LeBron James is not going to go to the Knicks. That's just not happening because, again, he's not going to leave a contender to join another team that's not a contender for Carmelo Anthony. It has to be the other way around. Salary cap wise, how does this work? Chris Bosh has to go. I mean, him or Dwayne Wade, but Dwayne Wade being a Miami Heat legend and all, I just don't see him going. So Chris Bosh virtually has to walk because there's no way they can fit all three or all four of their salaries. And I know people have been saying, oh, they'll take a pay cut. That's a massive pay cut you have to take. And, and Bosh is already the third wheel. You want him to be the fourth wheel? I don't see that happening. I think Chris Bosh either has to walk or get traded someplace else for that to work because salary cap wise it just wouldn't happen. Just sort of a last point I want to make. Carmelo Anthony strikes me as a guy that wants to win a title but he sort of wants to do it on his own terms meaning him being the best player and clearly if he does go to Miami and teams up with LeBron he wouldn't be the best player anymore. And I don't know how much he enjoys that. Look, not everyone can be Dwayne Wade. Dwayne Wade, he made a big sacrifice. Dwayne Wade was a top five player when LeBron James uh, joined with him. And I just don't think uh, every superstar, star player can do what Dwayne Wade did. And I certainly don't think Carmelo Anthony can do that. So, do I think this happens? No, I do not. Um, my thought is that LeBron James opts in, Carmelo Anthony opts out, Carmelo either leaves or he stays and signs a long-term deal with the Knicks. I just don't think they uh, there's any way they team up. Um, now, will I be surprised if it does happen? Look, look, I've said it. Nothing surprises me anymore. Um, so I'm not going to be surprised. But do I think it happens? I do not. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, comment below uh, about your reactions to this rumor. And uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And oh, also follow me on Twitter. Post a link for that below.